Hello and welcome back to Arsenal Online. Here you'll find the latest stories in this busy start to the season for the Gunners. Let's take a quick look at the latest news that's emerging from the Emirates Stadium. Arsenal vs Leicester City Match Preview a very confident Arsenal will host the Emirates' first home game of the season as Leicester City visit London with high hopes. Arsenal secured a well-deserved victory over Crystal Palace away from home in the opening game of the new Premier League season with a very exciting performance in this rebuilt squad. Mikel Arteta has done some fantastic preparations in pre-season and it is certainly showing. Arsenal completely dominated Crystal Palace in the first half in the first half an hour of their opening game and despite losing some control midway through the match they comfortably saw off Patrick Vieira's side. William Saliba in his debut finally for the Gunners got the man of the match and Gabriel Jesus began life brightly in Arsenal colours. He will be looking for his first goal on Saturday in front of the Arsenal faithful. There were other strong performances in the team and this Arsenal side now look ready to take on the big boys of the Premier League. First up is Leicester City in the first game of the season at the Emirates as Arteta seeks continuation of their excellent form so far. Mikel Arteta has a near full strength squad at his disposal but at his disposal except for players making their way back to full fitness. Takiro Tomiyasu, Emil Smith Rowe and Fabio Vieira are all regaining fitness and undergoing light training and Tomiyasu played 45 minutes for the Arsenal under 21 side this week. That's promising. Kieran Tierney made a cameo appearance against Crystal Palace which showed he is fit but may not be ready to start games just yet for Arsenal. However, Alexander Zinchenko will likely keep his place in the team especially after he provided the assist for Arsenal's first sc goal scored by none other than Gabriel Martinelli. The bad news for Arsenal is that Reese Nelson has suffered a severe injury that's likely going to keep the winger out for many months. This means that Arteta could look into integrating Marquinhos into first team activities especially after the Brazilian has impressed massively in the under 21s already. Vieira and Smith Rowe have chances to make today's match day squad, but Arteta is in no hurry to bring them back. The team is now virtually picking itself, with the Arsenal manager set to go with the same 11 that started in the opening fixture against Crystal Palace. The returns of some of the previously unfit players will boost the bench strength and improve the quality Arteta has during the game. But other than that, the squad has no problems and the Arsenal manager can rely on the players that got three points against Crystal Palace. So, the probable lineup is going to be a 4 2 3 1. Aaron Ramsdale had a few dicey moments against Palace. He needs to fully concentrate for the whole match. Leicester will be a challenge. Ben White, William Saliba, Gabriel, and Alexander Zinchenko. Well, they let nothing pass them. What a phenomenal back line. It's going to be an exciting season if these four line up continually. They were stunning. Thomas Party, Granite Zaka, Bukayo Saka. Zaka, Granite Zaka, got the first yellow card of the season. There's no surprises there. Some things will never change. But he and Party do seem to be reforming their partnership well after it was cut short last season by Party's injury. Young Bukayo Saka was phenomenal against Palace. He'll be looking to get on the score sheet this weekend after he narrowly missed out last week. 
Martin Odegaard, Gabriel Martinelli. Well, the new captain, Odegaard, felt his responsibilities. He put in quite a muted performance against Palace, but undoubtedly the new skipper will find his feet and he will strike fear once again into any opposition. Martinelli, well, what can you say? He opened his score sheet for the season with a beauty against Palace. And finally, Gabriel Jesus. What a signing. What a player. We expect great things from this Brazilian and he will certainly be wanting his debut official goal in front of the Arsenal home crowd this weekend. Some key statistics. Arsenal have not won their first two games in a season by clean sheets in over 50 years. They got one at Crystal Palace. Today, they'll be looking to rewrite that little bit of history. Another key fact, Arsenal have won their last three games against Leicester in all competition and they have scored at least two goals in their last three home Premier League matches. Leicester have 35 away losses to Arsenal. That's the most they have suffered against any top flight opponent. However, the Foxes are unbeaten in their last five Premier League games. But our prediction is for a wonderful, exciting and dominant performance from the Gunners in front of their home crowd. And they will win this at least 3-0. Thank you for watching our channel. Please subscribe, ring that bell if you would like more news from the Gunners.